Welcome back guys. Today I want to talk about the type of cerebral palsy I actually have. I talked to my mother the other day and um, I asked her what kind of cerebral palsy I had just out of curiosity because I was, she knows about the vlog but she doesn't really know um, the specifics about it. Um, so I asked her and she said I had spastic, spastic quadriplegic cerebral palsy, which means the quadriplegic part means that it affects all four of my limbs and sometimes my head. So that's, that would be why I'm in a wheelchair. She also said that I'm lucky, one of the lucky ones that actually has speech and stuff. Um... Because I was supposed to be one of the ones rendered without speech. Couldn't feed myself. Couldn't do nothing. So, um, right at this moment, I consider myself very lucky and not, not bad. You know, um, take life as it comes and do what I need to do. I'm lucky to be a wife and a mother. Um, so, you know... I'm here, I'm moving, I'm kicking. It's, I'm glad to be alive for whatever it, it means. But um, I did just wanna come on here and tell you guys I finally had an update as to what kind of cerebral palsy I have. I'm going to confirm this with my previous doctor once I get a hold of them. I haven't been able to get a hold of them initially from that first time I called them on the advice of my new neurologist. I'm sorry, I haven't brushed my hair. Chronic fatigue kicked in yesterday and I literally slept all day yesterday, got up for an hour at nine, went back to bed at probably 10 o'clock and Um, slept until one one thirty two o'clock today, so I don't know really what's going on. All I know is this, all the sleeping crap is for the birds. I woke up with a horrible, severe migraine today. Um, I got up and immediately had to take some ibuprofen for it. I haven't taken any of my other daily meds. Sorry, I just leaned my head down, hand down. I haven't taken any of my other daily meds today. So for yesterday's vlog, um, I'm uploading tonight since I didn't do one yesterday due to the chronic fatigue and being asleep all day. I'm going to try to get to bed quite early in the night when the husband goes to bed. Um, We'll see how that goes, though. Um, I don't know if it's just uh, lying on my mind and having it run when I go to bed, or if it's just something new with my body. I drink a little bit of water today to see if that would help. Woke up with my back, lower back hurting as well. So we'll see if it's like kidney bladder infection, something that needs to happen, antibiotic, I'm assuming not. Um, I'm assuming it's just my sleep schedule messed up. But anyways, I stayed up all night one night and still didn't, or yeah, I didn't go to bed the next day, all day. And still, the next day I slept until 2.33 o'clock. So I don't know really what's going on. Usually if I stay up all day and night, I can um, reset my my clock a little bit, but I, I don't know what's going on. Further updates on this will be in different vlogs. I did just want to come up on here and apologize to you guys that there was no vlog up last night. Um, so forgive me. And, um, and with that being said, I'm going to get off here. And um, you guys have a good night. And if you like this video, thumbs up. Run that like button over. If you didn't, thumbs down. If you're new here, subscribe. I don't bite too hard. What?
Ah, ah. Anyways, see you in the next video. Stay beautiful, guys. Bye.